Excuse me? M may I help you? I'm sorry to bother you, but could you give me a ride to the bus stop? It's just a few minutes up the road, and I would continue walking, but I'm just so tired. I'm sorry, but I have to get home, and I'm going the opposite well, direction. It's just a few minutes, and I'm just so tired from walking all day. I'm sorry, but I really need to get home. Please? Okay. I guess we're going to the bus stop then. Hey, you're welcome to come sit up front if you'd like. No, thank you. I prefer the back. So what's your name? Sarah. Sarah, it's nice to meet you. I'm Ethelda. Nice to meet you, too. Where are you headed? I'm driving back upstate for college. Very nice. What are you studying? Journalism. Why journalism? I, uh, I just like to write. So where are you headed? Niceville. <laughs> Sounds like a nice place. Where are you from? Miami. Oh, I would not like Miami very much. Too many people. Yeah, it's pretty crowded. I grew up in a very small town. Oh, really? Yes, less than 200 people. That's not too bad. Now that I think about it, growing up in a small town is better than growing up in a large one. In a small town, it's hard to get away with things. People know who you are. It holds you accountable for your actions. Yeah, I guess you're right. We should be getting to the bus stop um, in a couple minutes. I like you, Sarah. I'd like to get to know you better. What are your dreams? Um, writing. Mm. When I was your age, I knew that my dreams were much different from everyone else's. Oh, really? My dreams are more like impulses. I knew that they would be difficult to pursue. Yeah, I get that, but anything is possible if you put your mind to it. I studied medicine in college. I wanted to be a surgeon. Oh, that's cool. What kind of surgeon? A vascular surgeon. I find the inside of the human body utterly fascinating. I like spending time with you, Sarah. I like being here. Do you mind driving me just a little bit further? My destination is not very far away. I'm sorry, but I have to get home. We should be at the bus stop any second now. I wanted to look out the window. Oh, it looks like I have a flat tire. We're gonna have to pull over, um, check it out. flashlight so that I can check the tire? I'm very tired and would prefer to stay in the back. Okay, but we can't go anywhere until I get the nail out of this tire first. Thank <laughs> you. 